surface area of a combination of solids. Let us consider solids that are cylinder and two hemispheres as shown. If we stuck these hemispheres at the end of the cylinder, it will look like this. Now if we consider the surface of the newly formed object, we would be able to see only the curved surfaces of the two hemispheres and the curved surface of the cylinder. So the total surface area of the new solid is the sum of the curved surface areas of each of the individual parts. That is, TSA of new solid is equal to CSA of one hemisphere plus CSA of cylinder plus CSA of the other hemisphere. Here TSA stands for total surface area and CSA stands for curved surface area respectively. Similarly, if we take a cone and a hemisphere and combine them, we get a new solid as shown. And if we want to find how much paint we would require to color the surface of this toy, then we would need to know the surface area of the toy, which consists of the CSA of the hemisphere and the CSA of the cone. The total surface area of the toy is equal to CSA of the hemisphere plus CSA of the cone.